你认得出我是哪一位吗？那个时候我记得大家用的电话还是开关式的。我用的第一家最第一家电话，刚刚来新加坡的时候，因为妈妈要联络我，我是一个大哥大，还蛮黑逼的 ，flip 的，大哥大，还有 a n t e n n a 这样开上来。猜到哪一个是我了吗？难猜吗？所以呃，常常去的地方就是学校附近的一个 shopping mall， 最喜欢买什么东西啦？不能讲嘛，就说零用钱花来买什么。你看到现在还没有改，就是买包包。<笑>那个时候就整天很喜欢买书包，买不一样的书包。Can you recognize which one am I in the class photo? Okay, it's actually pretty easy to、uh, recognize because basically、uh, there are no changes from my current looks to my past self. The only difference is my hair. In the past, we we didn't have social media platforms like Facebook or Twitter, but instead we had something like Friendster. So Friendster is a very old school、uh, social media. It's probably like one of the first few. And aside from Friendster,、uh, we used to use MSN messengers, which currently I don't think anyone uses them anymore. 曾经的我。我觉得最大的一个标志的一个外貌方面的一个特征就是啊，我的眼镜啊，差不多应该有哈佛 k i 那么重了。我爸一定要我戴那种黑框的眼镜，那种啊很重，本来框就很重，镜片又很厚，视力很高嘛。发型也是我爸爸决定的，没得选择。飞机场，知道吗？这边直直的嘞，上面是平的嘞，真的是可以放东西在上面。所以这样的发型，我至少保保留了应该十年左右吧。Being a youth is that you wish you could grow up faster. You know, it's like, oh, I, I, I don't, I don't want to be like, like this, like young little kid anymore. I want to grow up fast. I want to be an adult and go and work. But when once you start working, you like regret you ever wish that you like wish all this away. Yeah, so enjoy your youth, enjoy school, enjoy the exams even, and enjoy your holidays.